All right, so first, I don't think we ever got to go to that pond, did we? Go away, mouse. This way. Oh yeah, we didn't get to go there because the freaking spooky lady was chasing us. Really glad that wasn't sis. Wait, what? Is this not? Wait, we do have to go further in. All right, because there's a point where we had to choose between down and up. It's further this way. One cliffs ahead. We could really stand to get some new lights in this town, I would say. That one has gone missing. BMG audio. Yeah, it might be a bit louder since I turned it up. She just wanted her little brooch back, you know? Oh my gosh. I, 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 I noticed it before, but it's so great that she got she has real eight directional sprites. Uh, it's extra noticeable with the, uh, the little eye patch, of course. World's bravest little girl. Puzzle piece 10 found! Torn shirt found. I like the mix. The mix of the playful and the grim is really works well. One shirt that was balled up in the street. It's all sun faded and beat up. Yeah, so that was, that was just a little collectible. Well, it's not even really... It's blue. I thought that was like a lake. There is a lake we'll be going to. But yeah, I don't think we got to explore this way. We are slightly being chased, and people are trying to murder us. Part two found. What's part two? Don't you mean like the puzzle piece? No, I don't have a puzzle piece. Part two, a mechanical part I've never seen before. Do I get a bunch of them to build something? on it. it was buried in the dirt. She must have. Oh, that is... Who knows? I wonder if there are no monsters now that I've beat the game? No, there was something was... something was active down before. I think this area is just clear because... yeah, there's still monsters. Because the, uh... The fallen lady was here. So, you know, adding extra enemies would be kind of a jerk move. Those red flowers. What what are those red flowers exactly? Is that flowers on a grave in general is you know a respectful thing, but I'm not sure if those are some sort of special you know somebody is dead flowers. I also think she slows down a teeny bit once you hit the yellow. Hard to tell. Actually, I'm gonna turn that BGM down a little bit. The wind's really loud here. Alright! Um. Hmm. Oh, yeah. We found a couple bits, but. See if we can head to that lake that we missed. Well, that we couldn't go to at all, because there was the horrible spider monster there. Dang old horrible spider monsters. Always in the way. Alright, take me away. To that pond, I guess. That bright light. I'm playing completely in the dark, and that bright light is like, wow. 
Though honestly, the glow from my monitor, this is one thing why the OLED Vita, I, I kind of miss it sometimes. The OLED is really fantastic, but it had issues on the Vita, like mostly the cost, but it had this LED mirror effect where um, it has little spots um, when the screen's completely black. And way too many developers let the screen go completely black. Like, I would have figured Sony would be like, hey, try to minimize having the screen be completely black for loading screens. Um, but most games still have totally black loading screens, and so you would see the little things. There must be some sort of Chivo for doing all of that crap with the letter. Maybe the Steam achievements aren't even active yet, I don't know. Uh, this, I am playing before the release date. I love her little backpack. Where can I get a backpack like that? Oh, is it still here? Oh, you just deftly walk around it. Okay. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I do like how you can get around pretty much everything, but you have to get so close to it. It's got a... What the fuck is that? It looks like an extremely evil um, heel slime with a brain inside. I see my town, but I can't see the sky. It's too dark to see the moon or stars. I see the factory chimney way off. That's a pretty sight. What the fuck is that? It's got a mouth, too. I don't like this pond anymore. We found a. We found a mummy?! hell? We found an entire mummy. Where's the mummy? A small mummy. It has a beak and also fins. I want to see the original form. That looks like a drawing from Binding of Isaac. Now they see it like that. Wow. It's a pretty pond, but it's dark so I can't really see anything. It's really scary. Oh, do you see those like branches? That is like that is screwed. With what? I already saw that. What the hell is that? No. I think in addition to them being near, it also indicates if they're seeing you and like trying to chase you. See, that was definitely worth checking out. You just have to be really gutsy to get around there. All right, um, where is next? It's so weird that middle bit is not marked on there. And that part there. Train crossing. Vacant lot. She's got a drawing of the horrible monster. Some of the stuff you don't get to see entirely because of how the in-game thing unoccludes <clears throat> the uh, map. So you can't see all of the horrible monster that she drew there. And I don't even know what's trying to be drawn here. I don't think we can go further that way. Um, we can't see this red X either. We never got to see what was inside the temple. All right, we'll we'll go to the temple next. I don't think there's too much left that we haven't seen. I guess there's this area. I'll go to the temple next. I like that it lets you explore around now that you've um, beat the game, and if you want to, you know, start over. You, of course, can. Let's see if there's anything here where Sis was. I guess it's kind of powerful to not name the characters, and it's just... It's not, you know, Sally and Sue. It's me and Sis. It's, you know, it's personal. Where's the Jesus statue? Isn't there's, there's one along this road, right? Let's try and hug this road and see if we can... Unlock that thing. Yeah, she definitely walks a little slower once it's in the yellow range. 
I never really would have thought I wanted an open world horror game, you know? But this has been really great. I, I definitely would not have expected a Japanese horror game to be, you know, open world. I mean, it's not like totally open, but it's open enough. It's... Alright, so yeah, we filled in that, I guess. So I really want to fill in maps, especially when maps are slow, have so much personality like this one. But yeah, um, I would not have expected a Japanese game to have, um, like, open world's fairly rare in Japanese stuff still. And I don't tend to like open world too much, honestly. Oops, that's not really what I wanted to do. We have so many coins, though, it doesn't, really doesn't matter. Is this... You know what? Let's look at this pond thing. This must have been blocked off before. Maybe I just noped out because of a bunch of monsters. Get some kind of pool? Oh shit. Oh, what is that? Oh, what was that? There are still enemies I haven't seen? Wow, they they really went all out for this. I I am impressed with the amount of enemies in this game. What? What? Was that a chicken in the road? What the? What? It's just it's just gone. It's just gone. I guess they did do the Silent Hill. Thing after all, is that a headless chicken? There's still so much to this game, I am impressed. He's my friend! He's the little friend. That's just... <laughs> Sorry, buddy! You don't go no eyes left. Does it really let you fall in? Or is that just... I don't know, I'm not gonna go that way. Mr. Headless Chicken. <laughs> this is the slightest sound you can hear when that happens. Yeah, Mr. Headless Chicken. Just, just my friend, Mr. Headless Chicken. Let's go around this way and avoid the, uh... Good old-fashioned horrible monstrosities on the road. What was that starfish thing? Like, holy crap. What is this, anyway? There's a headed chicken. Chicken. It's chicken. The chicken follows you, too. Wow. There's this whole thing that I never saw. I, I beat the game, and there's still a bunch... <gasps> Still a bunch of stuff I didn't see. I I'm I'm really impressed with this game. This is wow. But where's my collectible bits? I need my collectible bits. Oh, there's that motherfucker again. He's like a demon warning thing. Oh man, there's a whole area here. I like how these chickens have just adopted me as their lord and savior. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck off. I don't want your crappy patties, Patrick Star. Holy crap. That is screwed up. Got some, you know, some trash money. This town has way too many manholes. Especially manholes like this. These are very bad manholes. I don't like I don't like them at all. Jerk. Oh fuck. Oh, Mr. Chicken. Mr. Chicken, this is not the time. Dang, there was like a whole town segment here. I I, I thought it would just be like a, a little dead end with a little item to grab. Speaking of, I'm kind of surprised I haven't gotten any items. That's kind of what I was looking for. But uh, it's so cool that there's so much stuff that's not like totally necessary. Like, 
Horror games are usually very limited in terms of additional content. I don't like that guy. Oh, another Jizo statue. Nice. Okay, I think I'm gonna go to the temple after I take just one peek. Oh, the birds got stuck. <laughs> I'm so glad I met Mr. Headless Chicken. Oh, it's a 24 hour thing. Heck yeah, I love things that are 24 hours. Let's go check it out. I've got, you know, money. I'm a responsible adult with fiscal responsibilities. Heck yeah, it's so bright! 24! Yeah! Oh. Of course. Is it seriously just money? It's just money? It's just money I can't get. Ah, oh, man. I came all the way out here. I did find a cool new enemy. Like, wow. I haven't beat the game and didn't even see all of the enemies. We saw two. We saw the eyes. We saw the headless chicken. We saw the evil Patrick Star. I'm gonna call that a success. I love how these chickens are my friends. Also, that. Wait, is there an item that I never got? No. Um. There's a usable item I never got. I don't even know what it is. I guess if I find it, I'll do an addendum, but wow. This, this, there's a lot to this game. This is, I'm, I'm very impressed. All right, let's check out that temple. This is the last obvious era, area. Yeah, screw you, hands. I will, um, I'll still record while I find all the rest of the secret stuff, just in case, you know, because I'll want it for the guide anyway. But, uh, if I find anything extra cool, I'll definitely make a video for it. But for now, I really just want to see what is in here. All right. Board it up, Sean. Oh, you can't get in. The entryway is destroyed. Okay, I think we already explored this way, didn't we? Yeah, it's on the map. So, yeah, there's just some hidden item here. They really put all of that stuff to guard a doorway you couldn't use? It's a little cruel, don't you think? I guess it is a ruined shrine, but I figured I could get in there or something. Or that there'd at least be a shiny treat, perhaps? Maybe there is a shiny treat and I didn't see it because I was too scared to use the light. Which I'm still kind of scared to use it, but uh... There is a shiny treat. Aw, oh, crap. Okay. Yep, it's right there. Trophy found! Heck yes! Okay, you can pick up items even if you can't see the uh, thing then. Right, I think I picked up something on accident before like that. It's a, a trophy that literally grants you a trophy, assuming you're on the Vita version anyway. Where's the trophy? I want to see my trophy! I got a trophy! Heck yeah! A shiny reward for me who's doing her best! Congratulations! Thank you! No, thank you! And thank all of you for watching. This has been Yoma Wari. Oh, uh, okay. So I found something new. And, um, so I got- went back here to the, uh, racetrack on the, um, at the school. And this guy's still here. He's harmless and I couldn't find any way to interact with him. There's a bunch of enemies on the racetrack, including... Not you. Including something totally... Oh god, that. I, I've never seen that before. It's freaking huge! It's gigantic! And... 
I, I beat the game and I didn't see. Look at that! Holy shit! It, I, it's not super hostile, but but there's so many things I haven't seen. Even though I beat the game, like I, I'm I'm really impressed with this. I uh, wow. I wonder if there's anything we missed around here. You know, considering we just survived, you know, gigantic spooky monster. Nothing in the nothing in the sandbox or the the swing set. Oh, it's, it's a rock. Wonderful. Um, hmm. Doesn't seem to be much of anything. But yeah, that. that oh, it's like a creepy football player, dude. I've seen a couple of those. There's so many freaking enemies in this game. I'm really impressed. Yeah, it's. That's the girl from the uh, pool that we saw before. Yeah, there's, there's really a lot going on in this game, and I'm quite pleased with that. I'd say there's probably at least another couple hours of uh, finding everything left to do on top of what I uh, already took a look at. And I don't, I don't think anything... I don't think you can do anything with this guy. I think he's just there to give you the spoops. Which I, I like that. I like when there's enemies that just kind of... You get spooked. Is that a fetus? Is that a, that's a fetus! That's another new thing. It's a spooky fetus. With a little umbilical cord. That's adorable. You don't, you don't see too many of those. I was pretty impressed that... Um, I first saw things like that in Silent Hill. And uh, I was pretty surprised that... Um, Dead Space for a Western game would be... Like, they're cloned babies, but it still has freaking babies, and you step on the babies, and it's it's great stuff. Um, Dead Space is a fantastic game. I don't tend to play too many AAA things, but if I did, oh. See, the thing with those things seems to be you just... They don't they don't see you at all. Oh, Mr. Chickens! Mr. Chickens! So where are... I'm not sure where we are. There's this... There's this big tree, though. So... Oh, we found- what's this? What is this? Uh, it's a time capsule? Uh, oh, hmm, there's something buried under here. Ah, it's a time capsule. I'll leave it where it belongs. Oh, good old school tradition, I guess. I forget if we ever put a time capsule- oh! Skip that too fast. The biggest tree in school. Some People say someone's buried under it. Uh, and someone hanged themselves on it, and it'll start bleeding if you cut it. There are tons of rumors about it. I'm not sure if those are actually rumors. I think that might just be facts, considering all the other crap in this town. But I figured since the dog wasn't there anymore, which he's not, I might be able to find some stuff. Also, there was... back here, uh... I died before I got to thoroughly investigate this place. I didn't really come back. This is where I first learned that those child things were evil. Abusive note? Spooky. Incinerator. Uh oh. Alright. The, the one that's bleeding is it random, maybe? I know. Uh. What else do we have to investigate? I guess there's a bit more. Hmm. Is there a bit of that field we didn't check out? I just want to check out everything. There's so much stuff in this game. Is this across the bridge or before it? Can't really tell where I am. I think I'm- oh yeah, that's why I'm at the bridge, so I need to go all the way left and down. What's this? There's a rock. There's Mr. Can. A friend of mine told me, um, there's an achievement for kicking the can 50 times. I, uh, guess I didn't kick it quite that much. Well, we're here. Who 
Who needs Mega Man Legends 3? There you go, kick the can. Mega Man Legends 3 confirmed this game. Alright. Okay. Not really what I meant to do. Yeah, I was already in that bog sort of area, I think. Wait, where am I? Am I over? Oh, the drowned people again. I think maybe... I think that bog is the only thing that I haven't fully explored. Mr. Spider, please. I thought for sure that guy would go after the rock, but no. He decided to be a butt. Just a complete butt. Okay, I think I did fully explore here. Never mind. Never mind. What's. Oh, yeah, it's just. <gasps> oh, fuck off. I think we found that thing before, too. So, yeah. Alright. No, it's nothing. Oh, little fun extra. Sis talks to you a lot, like, she has different quotes. Lady that went missing in the rice field turned up dead. Yeah, I think we know who that was. Heard her corpse was found and sent back to her family. They arrested the murderer, too. It's kind of relieving. Uh. Mountain spirit that took me away was supposed to be a god once. Everyone in the town praised it. But why did it kidnap me? I don't have to be scared of that spirit anymore. Downtown is going to be totally bulldozed before winter. Good. Will the shrine town town be taken down too? Yeah. Looks like the shrine town to be taken down too. It's probably not good. It's sad without Poro. Poro wasn't mad, right? He's probably waiting for us in heaven. So let's play with him when you get there. Oh my god, the mummy is there. Ah. Take care. Go. Your left eye. Does it hurt? I'm sorry. You did that for me. Thanks for helping me. You pick up a lot of stuff. Don't take anything that's not yours. <laughs> uh, I mean, <laughs> we kind of have a skull, a cryptid, uh, a, <laughs> a mummy with a beak and flippers. You know, it's a little late for that. That's right, Barker. You going out again? Come home soon. I worry about you. I would. Why would you let her out? Should I buy some new shoes? Yeah, I would recommend that. I feel a presence when we're in this room. I wonder who it is. It doesn't seem evil. I wonder what it's doing here. Why does this town have so many spirits? See, I guess that's all she says, at least for now. I'm not sure if she says more things when you have more items collected. But, uh, yeah. For now, that is Yomawari. I think I'm saying goodbye for like the third time, but I think I mean it this time, I think.